Hey, hello there. Uh, this is Moniac, and a quick little introduction. I'm a uh, student at Media College in Amsterdam. I study uh, filmmaking and animation, and I thought I'd start a YouTube channel to show uh, people some tutorials, tricks, uh, works I'm work I'm doing. And uh, for this first tutorial of mine, I'm going to show you how to align a camera to a pad, a spline. Um, so let's get started. Start up Cinema 4D. Um, for the sake of the tutorial, I'm going to use a cube. Just keep it a little bit simple. This is good for practice. Uh, scale it down to about this. Um, yeah. So uh, the thing is, people mostly grab a camera. They go to coordinates. They keyframe the positions, the rotation, and yeah, it it does the job. But it's very stuttery and it's nowhere near as smooth as trick this trick I'm going to show you. So, uh, delete the camera. You're going to need a target camera. Um, and if you click here, you can give it a target. So, you have to grab the cube right over here, click and hold, and slide it right over here. So, what this does now is that the camera is always looking at the target, aka the cube. So, next thing is to grab a spline. We're going to choose the circle. You can use these shapes too, but for now the circle. As you can see, it's up. We're going to click on object, change this to XZ, so it's like this, and it's pretty neatly in the middle. We're going to grab the scale tool and size it up a bit, something like this. So the next thing to do is to click on uh, right click on your camera. We're going to give it a tag. We're going to Cinema 4D tags, align to spline. So as you can see here, it gives a little menu that opens when you click on this. And right here it says spline path. So you click on your spline, this is the circle. You click and hold and you slide it here. So what it does now is it puts the camera on the spline. And it follows the spline very neatly. While because we use the target camera, it also keeps looking at the cube. So as you can see, it doesn't do anything yet. So what you're going to do is, um, yeah, the thing is, it, it says here 0%. This is like 50% um, will bring it to the half of it, 100% will make a full move. So what you're going to do is you're going to click uh, Command or uh, Control if you're on Windows. We're going to click on Position. So it gives a keyframe right over here, as you can see, at 0. So we're going to move um, to about a hundred uh, and we're going to click here and type in a hundred percent so as you can see it made this orange so we're going to command or control click again and what it does now is it moves the camera see around it and to see how it looks like I'm going to click on this so we go in the camera and play it So as you can see, the camera moves in a circle around the cube while it keeps looking at it very neatly. Um, so yeah, we can do this with any shape, like I said. And to prove that, I'm going to delete the circle. I'm going to click on freehand and draw whatever, something like this. And we're going to click on the align to spline tag here. Click on spline, drag it to spline pad. Um, to make it a little bit smoother, I'm going to draw the keyframe to about 240. Going into the camera again, see how that looks like. So, yeah, this concludes my uh, tutorial. I hope this uh, was uh, useful to you guys. And, yeah. I'll make more tutorials. If you like this one, please let me know. Le leave a little message. Uh, give me a like. Thumbs up. And yeah, I'll make another tutorial soon enough. So have a nice day. Thank you for watching. And if it's your B-Day, happy B-Day.